Hi queens, welcome back to my channel. This is Be The Beat, if you didn't already know. And if you didn't already know, that means you are new here and I just wanna say welcome. Welcome on into the Kinky Street party today, okay? And if you are not new here, I just wanna say welcome back, friend, okay? Thank you for joining me again. Thank you for rocking with your girl, okay? So today's video, we're gonna get this head together. I don't know if y'all remember me mentioning some clip-ins I got a while back. I received these clip-ins a few weeks ago and I'm just now getting around to installing them. So y'all bear with me on that. But I got them from Kinkistry. If you haven't heard of Kinkistry, where you been, okay? She came in this cute duster bag, but I took them out. But Kinkistry is a black owned, woman owned brand and they specialize in natural hair extensions. Like they have wefted bundles, clip-in extensions, hairband wigs, full lace wigs I believe like they've got a little bit of everything okay but it's all like natural hair textures it mimics black hair in all different curl patterns um, 3a 3b 3c 4b 4c hair so whatever you want to get to match your texture or if you want to switch it up and work, rock a different texture it's up to you girl the possibilities are endless okay I initially bought these clippings to do a half up half down style so I got the curl pattern curl genics and I got them in 20 inches I actually got two packs the website suggests getting two packs to do a full head of hair and this is what they look like they come with like several different pieces like this is one track or whatever with the clips attached let's see how many come in each pack it said it on the side but i don't remember girl okay i will show y'all an example of what they look like so this is like a little small piece it has three clips on it and you just like pop the clip open and then you know insert it in your hair and then snap it back so very simple install and this is the curl pattern this is like fresh out of the package and i haven't wet the hair i haven't done anything to it this is the fresh curl pattern so you see it's springy and keep in mind when you're ordering extensions like this it's 20 inches when it's stretched out so you see how you know when i stretch it out it's clear it's clearly 20 inches it's past my boob but when it's curled up it's going to be appear to be shorter so just keep that in mind when you're ordering extensions if you're ordering extensions from anywhere and it's curly hair it's going to appear shorter than the inches you purchased when it's curled up so just keep that in mind <laughs> it comes with one two three four five five kind of larger pieces and then two mini pieces with just one clip on them so i'm assuming that's for like you know when you're getting like real close you know and you need to close up a small area so i'm gonna kind of size these out and figure out like where i need to place them i have never used clip-ins before so <laughs> this is new to me and I just have my hair in flat twist. I parted it right down the middle because I prefer a middle part. So, hate to break it to you, y'all, but none of this even matters right now because in a few minutes, I'm going to have to redo the whole head because I braided my hair down wrong. But just keep watching because this part of the video is actually going to show you how I install the hair. But then later on, you'll see that I start over and style it completely different. But just watch and you'll understand. It'll all make sense in a few minutes. But I just wanted to come on here. Future me talking like, girl, just, just watch, okay? If I leave it like this and don't add the other pieces, it's just like you can see my parts really well, but not from the front, okay? So I can rock up an Instagram because I can just take a selfie from this angle and you wouldn't see that, you know what I'm saying? But for in public, I definitely will have to rearrange my braids and or have leave out, which I don't really want to do. 
I might have to do. But it's cute. Like, I'm going to. Yeah, so this is what I was talking about. Like, I had to take out all the clip ins, take out all the twists in my head, and redo them to do the original half up half down style that I planned on from the very beginning. The whole reason I bought the clip ins, but I was feeling fancy and thought I could do something different. All right, y'all. So, completely redid the whole situation. Like, my hair is now parted and sectioned off to be in the half up half down style that I originally planned on doing. So now I'm just going to do my clip ins back here and then do my ponytail up here. I also left some leave out because I don't want to see those wefts. Like I don't want to run into that issue again and have to retwist all over again. So I did leave some leave out back here. So now we're just gonna start clipping. Like, I am over it because I was supposed to get this video done, do my makeup for a reel, and then take some pictures. But it's already after six o'clock, the sun's going away, so I'm kind of irritated. But it's okay, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. It's, okay. it's coming along, <laughs> y'all. This part up here, I'm gonna probably like clip around. I don't know how I'm gonna do the ponytail, but we gonna we gonna figure it out. <laughs> So let me get my little leave out, child, so I can see what it's doing. See, I'm just concerned about blending that, but we're gonna get it together, okay? <laughs> Cause this hair is also pretty brown and my natural hair is closer to a jet black. <laughs> so we'll see, but I think it's gonna be fine. I'm just gonna put some of the conditioner and twist it together and it's gonna be a twist out, period. It's so hard getting a straight part. Now we're gonna get this part together and do our makeup, okay? I'm also gonna trim these ends a little bit because I need to shape it. I'm just gonna use some Eco Gel to get this ponytail slick and then I'm going to use my Arcani Coil Care Edge Control. This edge control is top tier for me. Like, it doesn't make my hair curl up because like a lot of edge controls just make my hair curl back up and wave up. But this kind of actually holds my edges the way I need it to. So love that for me. Y'all should definitely try the edge control out. If you have a hard time with your edge control actually controlling your edges instead of just like waving it up. So I'm not sure how I'm gonna do my ponytail because I'm not gonna clip it on the ponytail. Okay, how am I gonna get the clip ins to stay in this ponytail, girl? Cause I don't know. I can like just clip this along and then make it a bun. Y'all know it looks crazy right now, but it's gonna come together. top knot I'm trying to decide is it big enough like is this big enough to match all this hair like you know what I'm saying like should I have added another one I don't know hmm I don't know we'll see in the end but I'm gonna go ahead and select these edges because the is looking a little sloppy to me right now. This stuff is just top tier to me. Like, like look at how that, look at it. Like, y'all see it. see these edges 
Like, now I gotta redo the whole ponytail because the edges are too late for the ponytail. But, y'all get where I'm going with it, okay? So, let me tighten up the ponytail. Baby, laid, okay? <laughs> and that's it, that's all. So, now I gotta figure out how to clip this back in because... <laughs> I was struggling, as you can see, okay? Okay, so I feel a little better about this one. I feel like it looks a little more balanced, and you know, I don't know, I feel better about it. I'm just going to, there's no real method to my madness here. Like, I'm literally just going to pick pieces and kind of trim them, so I'm no professional at cutting or anything, so I'm just going to do what I think looks nice. looks better than that you know so and honestly and truly with clippings like I might have to do this like multiple times like when I wear them another time I might have to shape them again because there's no way I'm gonna get the same clipping in the exact same place you know My sister's gonna be like, why didn't you get 20 inches if you was just gonna cut it? Like, girl, I don't know why I did it. <laughs> and I really can't even see what I'm doing, so I really should stop. But I just do what feels good. <laughs> I just go off the vibes. Weak. So I went to look at the back of my hair just to make sure it looked okay in the back. And it does. The only thing is the color difference. Because like I said, my hair is pretty close to a jet black and this hair is a dark brown so it's a little bit offset with the color but that's okay like when I do the twist out it's gonna look fine so I am going to go ahead and do my makeup while I still have a little bit of sunlight left so I can do this real and then I'm gonna twist the hair up so I can wear it in a twist out tomorrow girl you thought you ain't do no twist out you wore just like that and it was cute it was bomb i actually did try a braid out but i didn't like the way it looked it did not match with my hair texture leaving it boofy like this matched and blended with my hair texture a whole lot better so this is the end of the video i hate that i didn't have a proper outro but girl i was clearly struggling in this video but it's all right we got it together now and if you want to see a completed look like with face beat and all with the clip-ins head over to my instagram at be the beat underscore and you will see plenty of reels well not plenty but girl it's two you will see two reels and a picture of the completed look okay so just bear with me love y'all thank you so much don't forget to like subscribe and share beats and love <laughs> stay tuned <laughs>